But the fruit of the poor lemon is impossible to eat. Hi, I am Joy, and there's always joy in cooking. Today we will make something special and sweet. And that is, this is good for dessert or pampostre. And then I will call it lemon oatmeal lemon cheese bars. Okay, so let us start. I have prepared our baking pan. This is 8 by 12. And then I lined it with parchment paper. Uh, and then I have one cup all-purpose flour. The all-purpose flour that I have is unbleached. So Tiara sent this to me. Thank you, Tiara. <laughs> I am a recipient of their generosity. Okay. Also, I am using uh, rolled oats. Again, this is one cup. Given by Toto and Bibing. Salamat, Gid. Okay. And then, I will need, by the way, this food processor. No, to pulse everything. It would be easier than doing it by hand. Pwede man, pero it would be easier. And then I am using one half cup sugar. And then I am using also one teaspoon pink salt. Tita Boots, thank you. And then one half teaspoon baking powder. Okay. And then all I have to do is mix everything and then put this inside. No. Okay, I also used one half cup walnuts. No. So this is for the crust. No. This is for the crust. So I am mixing everything and then I will just pour, put it here. But since this is quite noisy, I will just show you how it is done later. Okay, stop. I am now grinding everything, no? so here it works well. Very easy to do with this machine. Okay, stop. And then I will pour, put in the melted butter. This is one half cup of melted butter. Okay. We will sip it, sip it. Can you know how it is? Mahal kasulina, mahal butter. Okay. Okay, so dali lang kita. Stop. I'm blending it now. Okay. I am pouring it now here in my bowl in order to blend it well. No? Okay. So, dali lang kita kita pusong ko lang ni. Okay, go. Stop. So now, this is the crust that I will divide into two. The, the, one, the half of this will be at the bottom and the other half will be on top. No? Okay. So I will just spread out this. That is why you have to use parchment paper. So I would rather use parchment paper than foil because uh, we all know the bad effects of foil aluminum if it is uh, used as cooking utensil. Okay, so there. No? So I will press it a little. Ah. Okay, there. So next is... Stop. This is how it would look like. Next, I will prepare the filling. No? With this, I have one can condensed milk. Mm, there is no milk made. So I just use... Walang tatalo, Alaska. Sige lang. Walang nun siya katamis, I do, I do not know. Pero, it will be neutralized because I will use also one half cup lemon juice. This is squeezed by Yen Yen. 
Now I'm using two of this and then I also use rind of lemon about one tablespoon no? and then I will add some grated cheese. Now this is one cup. Okay, so we will mix this until there will be curdle, no? so it will become thick. Okay. This is it. Okay, so you will see the lemon rind in the mixture. So now I will add the cheese. Uh, so I grated this cheese. This is cheddar cheese. It's not quick melt. It's just the cheddar cheese that you and me grew up with. Okay. So after this, I will pour it there. Stop it. I uh, I will spread this up to the edges. Hey, this is salty from the cheese and sweet from the condensed milk and sour from the two lemons. Hey, set up. Okay, after this, I will put in the toppings. The toppings is actually one half of what I put at the bottom. Hey, and then I will bake this. By the way, my oven is already hot at 350 degrees. So I will cook this at first 30 minutes and if you see that your the sides of your of your of this lemon square will be brown then it is done. So we will wait until it is cool to cut. Okay. Done. So now this is ready for baking. See you later. Okay, so here is the finished product. My own version of lemon cheese oatmeal bars. Hey, enjoy. Pero I want to give you a slice of it. Huh? So let us, let us, let us cut. Quick, quick, quick. Only a small portion. No, I will use this one. Wow, there. Yee, okay, so, kaunta, everybody, take care.